Hello, hello, I'm the official name raider. My job is to look through the first page of Google, review the nicknames provided by the internet, and then give my recommendations at the end. Today we're looking at Centret and Furret. Alright, so I've already looked through the first page of Furret and everything on Furret, and I gotta be real, I didn't know what to expect, but I already have them low. So I see Fuzzy, and I saw just from pulling up the spreadsheet that it said like fuzz butt so i guess we're expecting a lot of terrible jokes like that um nothing i've seen is good the closest that's good is ringtail and that's okay at best so i'm afraid this might be a short episode okay um truly so we have something to talk about link i I don't hate it because I think of Zelda, but he's not talking about Zelda. I assume he's talking about like a fucking chain link. I don't really care about that. Do I think it fits as far as Legend of Zelda? No, but if you want to throw away, sure. Muffer, Scarfer, no. Ferretta, Ferretchi, no. Those are offensively terrible. Runner is offensively stupid. Brownie, I actually don't hate. I think out of everything I've read thus far, Brownie's probably the best. And that's not saying much. Okay, so I actually did see Miko a couple times, but I didn't get it. Because it's been a very, very long time since I watched Pocahontas. Probably about 20 years. So I didn't quite remember that, but if you want to say Miko or Pocahontas... Uh, I guess that works. I don't know how many people are going to get Miko, but I also don't know how many people watch Pocahontas still or revisit that film. So, uh, there you go with that. Okay, so this isn't related to Furret, but because we already mentioned Brownie and its food, I'm going to acknowledge Nestle Crunch. Because as weird as it sounds, I think the food route is probably the most successful thing we're going to find because you can apply it to other things and it works because it's brown. Um... The only restriction about Nestle Crunch as a nickname is you have to have 12 characters. That's it. I also think naming it Nestle Crunch works way better than just naming it Crunch because it won't be obvious. Or you could just name it Nestle. That's fine too. Okay, so we've reached the bottom. It was a complete and total bust, kind of like I expected. And normal types are hard because there's no sort of generic nickname you could apply to them. You have to be very, very specific. So, let's finish by checking the spreadsheet real quick. Okay, I'll be honest. I don't think that will work. Firstly, because it's not a raccoon, it's a ferret. Secondly, because Team Rocket exists. So I don't think anyone's going to think of Guardians of the Galaxy. I like the idea, and I like that for like being different. But I think it's complicated by mostly the Team Rocket thing above all else. RJ works, I guess, if you wanted to do that. But again, it's a ferret, not a raccoon. Tom Nook would actually work really, really well. I'm actually surprised the fucking spreadsheet's the best thing we've stumbled across, yeah. I think a lot of people would get Tom Nook, and I think a lot of people would like the idea of Tom Nook. Especially today, while everyone's busy gushing about Animal Crossing still. Um... I don't hate Tootsie Roll either, but I apparently hit something on the keyboard that did that. Alright, well, that um, that surprised me, so I'm not going to close this just yet. I'm going to keep it open, because out of all of them, I think Brownie was the best. I just hate his reasoning behind it, because he said, Because it's brown! I'm like, you didn't think of the fucking food? Like, where does this... What makes that guy tick? It makes me so mad. It also makes me realize how lazy of a name brownies are when you're talking about, like, the food. Like, who came up with that name? Like, what, do you, what should we call this chocolate concoction? Let's call it brownies, because they're brown. Like, that's stupid in retrospect. But in other words, I think the best things out of it outside of brownie, and if you wanted to do other food, like if you wanted to do net... Nestle or Tootsie Roll I think kind of just comes down to which reference do you like I think most people are probably going to gravitate towards Tom Nook pretty sure he's not a ferret but like I get it I don't think people understand there's a difference between a raccoon and a ferret if you don't know consider like getting your eyes checked take a biology class go outside do something with your life to figure it out but other words 
I honestly think the spreadsheet had the best results outside of, again, just brownies. So if you've got anything better or more original, something I might like or other people might like, so they can use it for their centered and fair... Parrot? Parrot? Uh, provide it in the comments below. Give a thumbs up to the ones you think are good. And we'll try and keep the discussion going and come up with some good, unique and original furret nicknames.